Hello, I'm Dr. Mala and I'm an ophthalmologist and a cornea consultant. I'm working at Premier Eye Care, which is a part of Premier Neuro and Eye Care Center. And this is located in Isro Layout near Kumaswami Layout, Bangalore South. Corneal transplant rejections are very low, but they are the most dreaded complications of any corneal transplant. Remember, the key to a successful treatment is early treatment. Hence, the earlier you meet your doctor or the closest ophthalmologist is the key to a reversal of a rejection. This can be treated both in terms of drops to the eyes or tablets, also sometimes injectables. The line of treatment is to put the patient on steroids either in the form of eye drops or in the form of tablets or as IV injectables. Hence, very important is the patient examined and seen the reason for rejection and start the patient on steroids. Sometimes the pressures also can be very high. Controlling the pressures at the same time is also very important. With all this treatment, if the graft does not regain or retain its clarity, then it is going to fail. A failed graft again becomes opaque and the quality of vision drops. Hence, it becomes another indication for a repeat graft. But repetition is always taken up almost 5 to 6 months later because one needs to allow the immune system of the body to settle down before a second transplant is taken up. More than 2, 3, up to 4, one can undergo transplant. But remember, every time you go for a second or a third transplant, your rejection rates keep increasing. Hence, if you have undergone more than 3 or 4th transplant, it is ideal that you go for corneal keratoprosthesis where an artificial lenses are used with the help of a donor rim to retain or regain your vision.